Main Street is usually packed with cars parked and cars driving up and down the street. But starting today, Sundays are going to look a lot different. After COVID-19 hit Park City during their busiest season of the year. Thank you. It was nice chatting with you. This is a sight for sore eyes. When I started to open up again, I felt so emotional about the art, the artists and the clients. It's, it's I realized how much it means to me personally. Owner of Meyer Gallery, Susan Meyer, is happy to be able to open her doors, making the best of what some call a new normal. We all have our masks and our wipes and we're all cleaning like crazy and it's been a lot of fun. But if you take a closer look. Yes, I'm doing it for quarantine, but I get to walk down the middle of the street and that is cool. Cars are nowhere to be seen. And if they are, they're being towed. With our sidewalks here in Park City, they're so narrow that we didn't want anyone to feel put off and not come shop because of it. So we felt like having one day a week where those that want the extra space can get it. An initiative to take many steps toward rebuilding the local economy. Think about local first. If you can find that item in your community, that's going to help someone else out that's your neighbor. The pedestrian zone allows businesses to have a presence on the street, urging people to maintain their social distance. Normally I wouldn't want to spend $50 on snacks, but you know, once in a while I think that these guys are hurting and it's really nice to try and support them as best we can. So far, the turnout is promising. If they're more comfortable being outside, there'll be something for them to do. Main Street will be closed from 10 a.m. to 11 p.m. every Sunday until September 6th. In Park City, Katia Collins, Fox 13 News, Utah.